A lava lamp or astro lamp is a decorative lamp, invented in 1963 by British entrepreneur Edward Craven Walker the founder of the British lighting company Mathmos. The lamp consists of a bolus of a special colored wax mixture inside a glass vessel, the remainder of which contains clear or translucent liquid. The vessel is then placed on a box containing an incandescent light bulb whose heat causes temporary reductions in the density of the wax and surface tension of the liquid. The warmed wax rises through the surrounding liquid, cools, loses its buoyancy, and falls back to the bottom of the vessel in a cycle that is visually suggestive of pahoehoe lava, hence the name. The lamps are designed in a variety of styles and colors. Topic operation A classic lava lamp contains a standard incandescent or halogen lamp which heats a tall, often tapered, glass bottle. A formula from a 1968 U.S. patent consisted of water and a transparent, translucent, or opaque mix of mineral oil, paraffin wax, and carbon tetrachloride, P. 2. Line 30 The clear water or mineral oil can optionally be colored with transparent dyes. Common wax has a density much lower than that of water, and would float on top under any temperature. However, carbon tetrachloride is heavier than water, also non-flammable and miscible with wax, and is added to the wax to make its density at room temperature slightly higher than that of the water. When heated, the wax mixture becomes less dense than the water, because the wax expands more than water when both are heated, p. 1, lines 40 and 45 It also becomes fluid, and blobs of wax ascend to the top of the device where they cool, which increases their density relative to that of the water, and then they descend, p. 1, line 47 A metallic wire coil in the base of the bottle acts as a surface tension breaker to recombine the cooled blobs of wax after they descend. However, lava lamps made in China for the U.S. market since 1970 do not use carbon tetrachloride, because its use was banned that year due to toxicity. The manufacturer, Haggerty, stated that their current formulation is a trade secret. The underlying fluid mechanics phenomenon is a form of Rayleigh Taylor instability. The bulb is normally 25 to 40 watts. Generally, it will take 45 to 60 minutes for the wax to warm up enough to form freely rising blobs, when operating the lamp at standard room temperature. It may take as long as 2 to 3 hours if the room is below standard room temperature. Once the wax is molten, the lamp should not be shaken or knocked over or the two fluids may emulsify, and the fluid surrounding the wax blobs will remain cloudy rather than clear. Some recombination will occur as part of the normal cycle of the wax in the container, but the only means to recombine all of the wax is to turn off the lamp and wait a few hours. The wax will settle back down at the bottom, forming one blob once again. Severe cases can require many heat cool cycles to clear. In 2015, a new design was introduced into the market that uses ferrofluid in place of wax. Topic. History British entrepreneur Edward Craven Walker had the idea for the lava lamp in 1963 after watching a homemade egg timer, which was made from a cocktail shaker filled with liquids, as it was bubbling on a stove top in a pub. He hired British inventor David George Smith to develop the device and the chemical formula required put his idea into practice. Smith is credited as the inventor on the original U.S. patent 3,387,396 for a display device that was filed and assigned to Craven Walker's company in 1965, and subsequently issued in 1968. Craven Walker's company was named Crestworth and was based in Poole, Dorset, in the United Kingdom. Craven Walker named the lamp Astro and had variations such as the Astro Mini and the Astro Coach lantern. In 1965, two men named Adolf Wertheimer and High Spectre were intrigued by Walker's product when they saw it at a German trade show. They bought the American rights and began the Lava Manufacturing Corporation in Chicago, Illinois to sell what they called the Lava Light Lamp. 
In the late 1970s, the U.S. rights were sold to Larry Haggerty, who created a subsidiary of his company, Haggerty Enterprises, called Lava World International, which produced American lava lamps for over 30 years. Craven Walker retained the rights for the rest of the world, and took on two business partners in the late 1980s named Cressida Granger and David Mully. Eventually Granger and Mully took over the company and they changed the name to Mathmos in 1992. Edward Craven Walker remained a consultant until his death in 2000. Mathmos continues to make lava lamps and related products. Mathmos won two Queen's Awards for Export, as well as Best Multimedia Prize at the Design Week Awards. Astro Lava Lamp was launched in 1963 and celebrated its 50th anniversary in 2013. Mathmos Lava Lamps are still made in the original factory in Poole, Dorset. In 2003, American lava lamp maker, Lava World International, formerly known as Lava Simplex Scribe Internationale, shipped production to China. In 2008, they were acquired by Talon Merchant Capital and the name was again changed to Lava Light LLC. As of 2016, lava lamps were being sold under Lifespan Brands in North America. In 2018, the Lava Lamp brand was acquired by toy and gift maker, Schilling Inc. of North Andover, M.A. Topic. See also Lava Leverand, a random number generator that used lava lamps Plasma globe Bubble light Topic Notes Topic External Links Official Site UK How Do Lava Lamps Work? From the Straight Dope How Liquid Motion Lamps Work from HowStuffWorks.com Basics of Lava Lamp Convection, by Balaj Gear and Imra M. Yunosi, Fizz, Rev. E. 80, 046307, 2009. Lava Lamps Creators Mark 50 Years of 1960s Icon, BBC News. The History of the Original Lava Lamp, Flow of Lava.